Hi guys, it's Evie, and today I'm going to be showing you how I make puffy paint. Um, I'm sorry if my voice sounds really raspy. <clears throat> Still trying to get over a little bit of a cold, but yeah. So what I'm so let's get right on into it. The f the what you're going to need to make it is some um, lotion. This is just plain lotion. I know this is really dirty, but this is baby powder. But this also says, my baby powder says shower power powder. But yeah. Going to need a container to mix in. Something smooth with. I knew my, if you want to make it a color, you're going to need acrylic paint. Probably going to make it this color, but I'm not totally sure. This is just something I'm showing you. And something to keep your puffy paint in. So let's get right on into it. So your, there's no exact measurements. It just depends on how much you want. But I'm gonna show you how much I do. And you're probably going to need a paper towel because this will get a little bit messy. I just put like about this. This much. And then you're going to want to put the baby powder in. And it doesn't matter um, what way you do this. I usually put the baby powder in first, but I just saw the um, moisturizing first and then I just dumped it in then I'm actually not gonna do this color hold on let's see what color I want to do <clears throat> I want to do a dark purple actually I want to do a white yeah I'm going to do a white because I'm working on this squishy and this top is going to be white so yeah, you might need to turn the volume up all the way because you probably can't hear me. You don't need a lot unless it's a dark color because if it's dark color, baby powder and it's baby powder's white and the lotion that I'm using and most lotions are white. So yeah, you'll see that the baby powder does not want to be combined. So this is what it's looking like. And if you find once it's all combined and you test it out, that it's not a pigmented, pigmented, is that word, pigmented, not for you, then I to add more paint. And, I, and I'm probably kind of stupid to use a toothpick because there's so much here, but meh. Yeah. So you're using a toothpick, I told you to use a toothpick, so it's like, So, just mixing, and I'm mixing, and I'm mixing, and this is what it looks like. It looks pretty solid. <coughs> Excuse me. And, yeah. Just mixing, and I'm mixing, and I'm mixing. So, I'm going to try this out on this squishy. I'm going to try it a little bit out on the bottom to see if it's big. Pigmented. Yeah. It's pretty pigmented. I also put it on blue, so that's why. But I think I might need to put three coats on for this. So yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna make two videos. One, I'm gonna show you that I didn't make this. I bought, but I did. It was just plain like tan color, but right here too. So I thought it was kind of boring, so yeah. I like to paint with toothpicks also, just in case you wanted to know. This is going to be a base. And you can even paint with your fingers because this is totally pretty much non-toxic because I'm using Crayola paint. And I know Crayola paint is non-toxic, so I'm actually going to paint with my fingers. You can paint with a paintbrush, whatever you want. 
Oh, and if you didn't know, this is a squishy. <laughs> Definitely going to need a few coats because this is very red. Uh, but yeah, I'm not. <laughs> just in case you can eat it, it's totally non toxic because lotion and baby, it's a lotion and baby powder I'm using are non toxic, and I hope you are too, too because you are putting it on your hands and your body. I find the best way to dab, dab, dab it on. It's not working very well because this is very dark tan. So, yeah. But it just makes the desired amount you want. So, this is what I'm working with right now. And then, this puffy paint usually takes about an hour um depending on how much you put on but an hour to two hours but i usually i have a fan that i can put my thing in front of to make it dry faster but it'll only increase the time by about 15 to 20 minutes but if you want that difference go for it so thank you guys for watching please comment like and subscribe and thank you for getting through me because my oh, my voice is very raspy and um yeah so bye guys